Water is life. This simple, clear liquid is essential for almost every function in your body. But did you know that the right amount of water can also help protect your kidneys and prevent serious damage? In today's video, we'll dive into the vital connection between hydration and kidney health and answer one of the most important questions. How much water should you drink to prevent kidney damage? Let's find out. Your kidneys are two bean-shaped organs that play a crucial role in filtering waste and toxins from your blood. Every day, they filter around 50 gallons of blood to remove excess fluids, waste products, and toxins, which are then flushed out through your urine. But here's the key. Your kidneys need water to do this job effectively. When you're dehydrated, your blood becomes more concentrated, making it harder for your kidneys to filter it efficiently. Over time, this extra strain can cause damage to your kidneys, increase your risk of developing kidney stones, and in severe cases, lead to kidney disease. So, how much water is enough to keep your kidneys healthy and working at their best? Let's break it down. Generally, the amount of water you need depends on various factors such as your age, weight, activity level, and climate. The well-known rule of 8 glasses a day is a good starting point, but for many people, it might not be enough. So, how do you know if you're not drinking enough water? Here are some common signs of dehydration. Dark-colored urine, feeling thirsty often, dry mouth or chapped lips, dizziness or lightheadedness, fatigue or low energy, difficulty concentrating, dry skin or dry eyes. These symptoms are your body's way of telling you it needs more water. If you notice any of these signs, it's time to grab a glass of water to give your kidneys a much-needed boost. One of the most painful consequences of not drinking enough water is kidney stones. Kidney stones form a minerals in your urine like calcium and oxalate, crystallize and clump together. This often happens when your urine is too concentrated due to dehydration. By drinking enough water, you keep your urine diluted, which prevents these harmful minerals from crystallizing and forming stones. Staying well hydrated is one of the simplest and most effective ways to reduce your risk of developing kidney stones. While most people can follow the general rule of 2-3 to three liters of water a day, certain groups may need to adjust their intake. Older adults, for example, often have a reduced sense of thirst, making them more prone to dehydration. It's important for seniors to consciously drink water throughout the day, even if they don't feel thirsty. On the other hand, athletes and people who exercise regularly may need more water to replace fluids lost through sweat. A good rule of thumb is to drink an additional liter of water for every hour of strenuous physical activity. When it comes to hydration, you might wonder, what type of water is best for your kidneys? The good news is, plain water, whether from the tap or bottled, is usually all you need to stay hydrated. If your tap water is safe to drink, it's the most cost-effective and environmentally friendly option. Mineral water can also be a good choice but it's important to avoid water that's high in sodium or other minerals that could add extra strain to your kidneys. If you're unsure about your water quality, using a filter is a great way to ensure you're drinking clean, healthy water. While it's essential to stay hydrated, you might be wondering, can you drink too much water? The answer is yes. Drinking excessive amounts of water in a short period of time can overwhelm your kidneys and lead to a condition called water intoxication, or hyponatremia. This happens when the sodium levels in your blood become dangerously diluted. The key is balance. Instead of chugging large amounts of water all at once, aim to drink small amounts consistently throughout the day. This keeps your kidneys functioning smoothly without overloading them. Here are some easy tips to help you stay hydrated and protect your kidneys every day. Start your day with a glass of water to kickstart hydration. Carry a reusable water bottle with you and sip throughout the day. Drink water before, during, and after meals to help with digestion and hydration. Set a timer or use a hydration app to remind you to drink water regularly. Eat water-rich foods like cucumbers, watermelon, oranges, and leafy greens. By making hydration a regular habit, you can keep your kidneys healthy, your energy levels up, and your body functioning at its best. For those who already have kidney disease, hydration needs can be different. If you have a condition like chronic kidney disease, CKD, your doctor may recommend a specific amount of water 
based on your stage of the disease and overall health. Drinking too much or too little water can be harmful in these cases, so always follow your healthcare provider's advice. Managing water intake carefully can help prevent further damage to your kidneys while supporting overall health. Your kidneys work tirelessly to keep your body healthy and balanced, and one of the best ways you can support them is by staying properly hydrated. By drinking enough water each day, you're not just quenching your thirst, you're protecting your kidneys from damage, preventing kidney stones, and promoting overall wellness. So, remember to make hydration a priority. Your kidneys and your entire body will thank you for it. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more tips on how to live a healthy, balanced life.